This is the room when we first move in. And this was it once it was all decorated and moved into. The good thing about Easter Day is that it does have a wash basin, which makes the shared bathroom situation a little bit better. On the topic of shared bathrooms, I just want to point out that it's not as bad as everyone makes it out to be. I don't think it should be a deciding factor in which accommodation you choose. I mean, as of yet, I haven't had an issue. You have three toilets and two showers. It's rare that one's not available at a time. I'm going to show you a quick look around the kitchen but not for too long because my flatmates are down there and I don't want to annoy them. What are you cooking there to Ben? I actually yeah. Ben. <laughs> okay so hopefully you now Sort of know what to expect from easter day i think key pointers are that it's shared bathroom non-suite it's one of the cheaper accommodations um there's 13 people in a house five people on the third floor five on the second and three on the last one in the kitchen and yeah i think that's it um it's a house not a flat so i quite like that it feels more homely to me but some people do prefer the um flat accommodation but I don't think any of the accommodations in Bath are bad, like everyone seems quite happy with theirs, so yeah. <laughs>